Damn it! Out of curiosity, um, out of curiosity with everybody on, on the, in the call, and I can also this this question also applies for everybody on the Twitch chat too. Who okay, likes spinach in their pizza? Spinach in their pizza? Yeah, I've seen that before. I've never yeah, had good. spinach. Like never in my life. Yeah, fine. I don't really like the sweet. And that's well, not me. Crazy. Like. That's not me being your typical child okay. and just avoiding vegetables like the plagues. I like carrots and I like lettuce. But I've never been exposed to spinach. Ah. Like, it's never found its way to me, or I've never found my way to it. That I remember. <laughs> Cherry Bump, thank you for following. Different strokes for different folks. As long as yep. it's not pineapple. As for my pizza, mine wasn't, um, I didn't put, uh, spinach in mine because I don't know, like, certain types of spinach or kind of like But, um, I decided to get black olives with extra cheese. In a white sauce. Damn it. Hmm. You know, like how in some pizza places, instead of the usual, um, Red sauce, they would have some kind of special white sauce. Yes! Sauce. You know what I'm talking about? Mm. I believe so, yes. I feel like I'm That's... using all of my brain capacity to try and figure a way to make white sauce not sound weird to me. God dang it, Logic! I'm trying. God damn it. I'm okay. trying. Damn I'm actually it. trying. Well, that's the point of trying. That's you either succeed dirty. Or you that's dirty. No, just because my daughter likes spinach in her pizza, that doesn't mean ah! you should be doing dissing me like that. Jeez. Damn it! That wasn't a diss. What planet do you live on? The fact that they weren't inviting me to a pizza place, to a pizza party, because of the fact my daughter doesn't like sp like spinach in her pizza, and obviously they don't. Speaking of pizza, I'm looking at a place that has a bacon mac and cheese pizza, and I'm I'm slightly curious. Okay, that sounds like the most interesting idea. I mean, you're putting carbs on carbs. Cause let, no, yeah, cause, carbs. yeah, let's face it, pizza is filled with carbs. It's one of the most unhealthy like dishes to have. You say that as though I don't know this. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going the distance. I mean, if they had something like a certain meat thing in there, like you know the bacon you said, like that's fine. Like that's that's the normal thing. I mean, I've seen weird combinations of foods, so but at least it's not like pizza with broccoli that my sister seems to like. Why? Great job, San Francisco! You ruined pizza. I like it when broccoli is more raw. Yeah, I don't mind it. I, don't, I prefer raw over cooked. I used to, I used to eat raw broccoli when I was a kid. You know, it's it was weird back when I was a kid. I actually liked broccoli because it was a fun like. I always had an imagination. I was like, oh, cool, there are little trees that I'm eating. But then I found out that apparently some kids don't like broccoli. I'm like, what? I like broccoli. Yeah, I like broccoli too. Okay. Golden, you and I think the same way, because that was me too when I was a kid. When it came to broccoli and cold flour, I always had the Asian as trees, and I was kind of sad. I remember now. It was the um, it was a it was a Tiny Toon episode. It was like a detective story, and how the um, how the episode ends is. Whoa, hang on a second. 
Now, how it ends is that Buster says, like, kids don't like broccoli. Like, uh, what? Kids don't eat broccoli, yeah. Reminds me of a Kids Next Door episode. Or that Powerpuff Girl episode where they're, like, grossed out by a bunch of broccoli, and then there's, like, marsh and broccoli. Like, Come on, girls, we gotta eat them to beat them. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's sad that, that I remember that line friggin'. so much. Have you guys, you probably haven't seen it because it seems to be a UK exclusive thing. But mm -hmm. friggin', this new healthy eating ad that appears on TV every so often, where you got people like Judge Rinder and other, you know, people you see on those channels talking about eating their vegetables to defeat their vegetables or some shit. It's just like, how do you function? How do you function? I'm going to drown you. I'm going to drown you like a sack of dumb puppies. <laughs> because they're cute and cuddly. Are you coming on to me? <laughs> Goddamn penguins, man. They just bounce me all over the place. I'm trying to collect some fucking coins. Piss off. Hey, oh, well, I, I love stuff. I mean, I'm more concerned about the penguins because penguins can't fly, can they? Not in this game. Apparently, these penguins can. Yeah, they can in this game. They don't Chris. seem to be able to do it very well because they're just like flapping their. I'm now just suddenly getting. On a penguin. I'm suddenly getting memories of a freaking Lion Guard episode, like. Of course, not many people watched it, so they wouldn't know what I'm talking about. <laughs> but basically, <laughs> basically, uh, they, uh, they found a place where they have like a cold sec. Oh no! Oh, fucking plummeted into the pit. But no, um, they found a location that they have like one, like a habitat for almost every creature, and one of which is an area for penguins. And um, the hippopotamus character comes in and he says, "Poa." <laughs> it's just like it's his own call sign. Uh, Beshi, that's who it was. Um, and the freaking penguin's like, He ruined our sled! Ah! Ah! To the abyss with you. Oh, yeah, oh fuck you, Vla uh, Vlad. Uh, Trent Webster. <laughs> Wait, Vlad's here? Yeah. Oh, hey, Vladdy Daddy. Wait, Wait. Vladdy Daddy, what? <laughs> what? It's an old name. It's an old nickname. <laughs> Which one? Oh, Trent. Okay. Oh no! Oh, oh shit! Oh! Did I call his identity? <laughs> I think he, yeah, he was trying to keep it secret, but I'm like, you know, I recognize the header dude. Also, he kind of gave his username away when he was responding to a um, uh, keyframe on Twitter. Shit! Oh my I'm god, sorry, this is like, fucking brutal. Oh god, OH GOD! Like when, when Jess mentioned that nickname that Riley had, the Vladdy Daddy one, the first thing I thought of saying was, well, like, <laughs> when they call you the Impaler. <laughs> oh god, they're hashtagging it. I refuse to hashtag this. You guys can do it if you want. I refuse. I refuse, like, a lot. Skill is asking, did you have any pets growing up? Of course I did. I've only oh, had yeah. dogs in my life. <laughs> <laughs> I, had... one that I don't remember that my parents used to own. I was like itty bitty when they had that dog. Then we eventually had other dogs later on in our lives. Um, one was a mixed, was obviously a pure mutt, full on mutt. I don't, I, I don't even remember. You know what? I'm gonna save these for when I get over the freaking ice obstacle thing. Whoa! I gotta bounce off of those. Oh god, it's a bomb! It's a bomb! It's, it's a, a bomb. bomb. <laughs> anyway, um, I then had we then got it a scary new chihuahua, or a, like not the miniature ones, but the ones that, like. Ah oh, crap! The, kind of one ah. of the bigger ones. 
Oh no! Ugh. Um. I almost then, fucking had it. Then later on, my dad got it a bull mastiff. Got the one bull. He got it two. He had one of them before. And then I got it my, my toy poodle. And then he got it another bull mastiff. Uh, I'm such an indecisive bastard. <laughs> well, it sucks to be you then. Wait! Oh, I could just, like. I'm trying to figure out a place to order. <laughs> Yeah, um, I was with him at BronyCon, along with, uh, Wolfhead, and, um, what's his name, Def Horse, and there was somebody uh -huh. else, there was a few people, um, yeah, yeah, no, there was a lot of people, uh, that was, that I got to meet in person, that was, uh, fun to, do. no, oh, I was doing so fucking good, damn it, I gotta stop popping around like a goddamn rabbit, okay, this is gonna be hard to, 